Hi, my name is Stuart Adams and today I will be explaining to you one of the many ways that one may become famous. Today's topic is tennis. The first thing you must do to become famous is to make sure that your clothes coordinate. It is a mathematical improbability for you to lose when your outfit matches. Just ask Venus Williams. Or was that Serena Williams? Why do you think they call a game of tennis a match? You must cultivate an image that oozes. Hey, I'm a famous person who plays tennis. I mean, seriously, take a look at what I'm wearing, people. Do you think Farinas Williams got to where they are by dressing normal? Secondly, you must always use tactics of intimidation to create dissonance in the mind of your opponent. After all, half this game is 90% mental. In a trained hand, the tennis racket appears surprisingly similar to a Scottish Claymore. Trust me, the last thing your opponent wants to be thinking about at that moment is Mel Gibson in a kilt. One thing that always makes for a more intimidating tennis match is alcohol. The flaming forehand is sure to subdue your opponent on multiple levels. If you ever happen to make a bad shot and make yourself look like a complete idiot, just finger the strings of your racket to imply that if your strings had been lined up, you wouldn't have missed the shot. In closing, I would just like to remind all of you that the most important thing to do when playing tennis is to always do your best. And when the ref makes that horrible call, let him know.